The Marlin Model 60 is a gallery of guns deal of the month. I'm Joe Kurtenbach with the National Rifle Association, and today we're taking a closer look at the Marlin Model 60. Originally introduced in 1960, the Model 60 has had a basically continuous production run of now nearly six decades. During its production life, the basic design for the Model 60 has not changed very much. It's chambered for 22 long rifle, it's a semi-automatic design, and it holds 14 rounds in a tubular magazine underneath the barrel. And one of the a distinguishing features of the Model 60 is at its introduction, it was Marlin's first uh, tubular magazine to use a brass inner tube on that magazine. So a nice change to help reduce corrosion and rust uh, that they were getting with steel magazine tubes. The barrel is 19 inches long and it is rifled with Marlin's micro groove rifling. So it's proven to be a pretty accurate way of rifling those barrels. And as well, it has very usable sights. You have a ramp front and an adjustable rear. Now the stock on these Model 60s is really nothing to write home about. This was a place to save some money, but it is a hardwood stock with a Monte Carlo style comb. And a couple final features are the cross bolt safety and the last round hold open feature, uh, which was introduced in the Model 60 in around 1985. Now this Marlin has a legacy of being one of the most successful American commercial firearms with millions produced and sold. And a lot of that success came from the fact that these guns worked. They were reliable um, and they were chambered for the 22 long rifle, which was a great plinking, really fun to shoot, as well as a small game cartridge. And finally, they were affordable, which made them very accessible to American consumers. So for more information and local pricing, click the link below.